Marianne Almaguer, and she is some kind of fighter. Former Women's International Boxing Federation Super Welterweight Champion. Tough as nails, and she is looking forward to this as a stepping stone to Christy Martin. Meanwhile, she's got a mighty big stepping stone in the person of Lucia Riker, former world kickboxing champion. Christy Martin may have be gotten most of the publicity, but Lucia Riker, folks, you've got to take a look at her. She's one of the meanest fighters I've ever trained. I mean, if she hurts you, she'll finish you. Women are not supposed to do this, but I have news for you. As a former kickboxer, Lucia Riker won three world titles. Her only loss in 39 fights came incredibly against a man. On top of the world, the native of Holland traded it all in four years ago and moved to Los Angeles, seeking a new opportunity. Boxing got into me. It's in me, it's in, in my body. I like the challenge, the challenge, challenging myself. And the only way for me to really challenge myself is in there, in the ring. Lucia has been a quick study under trainer Freddie Roach, mowing down her first nine opponents, eight by knockout. She has great footwork. She can move. She can punch. She's a complete fighter. She can do it all. Super lightweight champion of the world, Lucia Riker! Her pugilistic prowess has spurred interest in a showdown with self-proclaimed women's pound-for-pound -pound champion, Christy Martin. Yes, there has been an offer of $1.5 million for us to split. Wait a minute. She doesn't have half the drawing power that I have. I'm the one that's going to sell the tickets. It's my name. She needs me to give herself credibility. I don't care. The winner takes it all. If she really believes she's the one, let's fight for it. I really don't care. The money's not important. The fight is important. I don't see Christy Martin being too much of a problem for Lucia, to be honest with you. Um, is Christy Martin ready for Lucia Riker is the question. She thinks she has everything and she's the one and she comes all the PR and da da da. How long is she going to sit on that throne? A real queen will stand up and defend her crown. Uh, Lucia Riker came here to the U.S. four years ago for a vacation, decided to spend a lifetime here. And she has moved on from the world of kickboxing to now boxing as we rejoin you here now ringside. And this really ought to be a match between two very impressive women. Talk first about Marianne Almaguer. Oh, very impressive uh, from Marianne Almaguer, which is, uh, she's been a pro for about six years now, and uh, she's been inactive for about a year. But I feel that uh, with this fight here tonight against Lucia Riker, she's, she trained hard, she's great in great shape, physically, mentally, she's ready for this fight tonight, ready to give the fans a great show. And one of the biggest challenges for Marianne was getting down to weight because she has fought as high as 190. Gil, I've heard you talk about an awful lot of boxers in my day, but you really gave an awful lot of praise to Lucia Riker. I, I think that uh, Lucia Riker is the, is the best woman boxer in the world. I mean, she has it all. Those all the combinations, does everything, as strong as a bull. But she's in, she's in with a question mark. She's in with somebody that's in a, a higher weight class and a southpaw. Despite the fact that her opponent has been away a year, this could be a tough fight. Could be two challenging points indeed, Gil, as we take a look at the tail of the tape. Well, again, the weights are just about the same, but Almaguer had trouble making the weight. I guarantee she weighs 148, 149 right now. Lucia Riker is the WIBF champion. And for this bout, no standing aid count, no three knockdown rule. And again, only the referee can stop the fight. Neither fighter can be saved by the bell in any round. And the headbutt rule, again, in effect. And let's check in now with Michael Buffer. And now, ladies and gentlemen, Top Rank Incorporated, along with Budweiser, present six two-minute rounds, ladies boxing, super lightweight division. The judges will remain the same, and when the bell rings, your referee will be Steve Smoger. Introducing first, fighting out of the red corner, wearing blue, trimmed with white. Her weight, 140 pounds. Her professional record, nine victories, seven by knockout, with only one loss from Midland, Texas. Here is Marianne Gorgeous Almaguer. And her opponent across the ring fighting out of the blue corner. 
She's wearing black, trimmed with red, weighing in at 139 pounds. Her professional record, a perfect 9-0, including eight knockouts. She currently holds the world title, title not on the line tonight. Ladies and gentlemen, from Los Angeles, California, here is the undefeated world super lightweight champion, Lucia Riker. Ladies. Ladies, you were giving you instructions that the way I want you to obey my commands at all times, respect the belt at all times, and above all, protect yourself at all times. Touch gloves. God bless. Sean, I know you've seen some good action in your years. Your thoughts about this one? In the corner of Marianne Almaguer, her brother Adam tells me they're still going to box from the outside. The reason they want to do that is they want to show that vexing southpaw stance. Although I think Lucia Riker is going to come out on top in this fight. But I tell you that, fellas, this could be a strange time for Lucia Riker. She has never faced a southpaw. All right, Sean, thank you very much. And Gil, you said this is a match that you probably would not have made for Lucia Riker, her first effort on national TV. Well, Riker is coming out exactly the way I would expect her to come out. Very, very busy and throwing punches. She nailed, she nailed Anna Go in a straight right hand already. And a reminder, these are two-minute rounds, and Lucia Riker, very technically sound and sharp, not many weaknesses at all. And a lot coming from her experience as a good kickboxer. Shot, good shot. Let her out, Lucia. Let her out. Push off. Push and off right interestingly, hey, Lucia fight, didn't fight. find out that she was fighting a southpaw until a week ago. Well, I don't feel it's going to create problems for Lucia because look at her footwork. She's on her toes. She's using that right-hand lead, which is very impressive coming from Lucia Riker. Yes, indeed. Impressive was that left hook. Flush. On the 10 for a million oh, yeah. Yeah. And it wobbled her. Hey! Has she cleared the cobwebs? Play is over. So it is over. First round by Lucia Riker. And we were concerned whether or not finding out a week ago that she was fighting the southpaw would be problematic and one who was accustomed to fighting heavier. But Gil, you said the best woman fighter in the world. I, absolutely. That's the way I feel about it. I think she could probably beat a lot of men right now. She thought, does. Those perfect combinations, good balance. What are you making faces at? I'm just sure, I'm happy that she's not in my weight class because <laughs> this is a tough woman, let me tell you. She can really, she can really bat, but you know, she did exactly the right thing. Her opponent, her opponent was out of action for a year. She jumped right on it. Didn't give her a chance to get started. Speaking of jumping right on it, Gil, as you take us back through the replays here, again, so impressive with how excellent a tactician and technician she was in executing. Beautiful left hook that she will be connecting, Gil. Well, that, that's her best point, that short little left hook when she goes back with it. But every punch has leverage on it, Oscar. She's really, really bangs you and hurts you with just about anything she throws. There's that short left hook, and the fight's over. Remember, when you fight her, keep your right hand up. You understand that? <laughs> <laughs> well, Oscar's already said he would not get in with her indeed. Well, not much doubt about this one, but let's go up ringside to Michael Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Steve Smoger calls a halt to the bout. The official time, one minute, three seconds of round number one. The winner by knockout victory, still undefeated, still considered to be pound for pound, the best in the world among the ladies. She is the undefeated Lucia Riker. Gil and Oscar, apparent why Lucia Riker says, hey, let's do it winner take all with Christy Martin. I'll give her the 1.5 million if in fact she can take me. This is tough company indeed. And she's standing by with Sean O'Grady. $1 million for Christy and me. The winner takes it all. Just told me. Very shy and unassuming Lucia Riker. You know what? You looked as surprised as anyone when you caught her with that left hook in the first round. Why? I have no idea. They all told me the left hook is going to work. I had problems in my training with the southpaw. That is your your favorite weapon. I want to tell you, 
I didn't want to tell you in the interview because I thought you were going to tell her. Oh, I, I would never tell her, Lucy. We found out two weeks before it was a southpaw, so I had to change the plans. I would never tell her, but you know that yeah, it's but important. You never know, you know. You, maybe you want to just, you know, to, you know, fire up a little bit. You never know. So I didn't tell anyone. But when did <laughs> you know? When did you know you had her? I didn't know. I thought because I, you know, I know she's tough. I thought she's going to get up and we're just going to continue. Did I thought she? I'm going to win on points. I'm going to be really fast. Da 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 da. Off to the side. Da 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 da. I'm not going to look for a knockout, and then... Whoop, but did you ex expect her to come at you like that? She I didn't, was undaunted. I didn't expect anything. Just, I, I thought, I only think of what I'm going to do. One, two, three, off to the side. Light on my toes, because she's big. She blew up like 10 pounds, I, I think. Yeah, at, after at, the, the land. Yeah, yeah, she, well, she was, was a bit bigger than you in this fight. What does this fight do? Better. What does this win do for you? Uh, this one makes me really happy. Yeah. yeah. You, you mentioned earlier you want Christy Martin. How real will that will, is that fight? How real? Bob just told me one million dollar to win and take it all. Christy, come on, baby. We gotta do this. How long are you gonna wait for me? Till you're old and crippled. Come on. We gotta do this. All right. Lucia Riker wants Christy Martin, but uh, she gets a nice victory tonight. An early knockout. JB. Lucia not only understands the art of boxing, but the art of hype as well. Don't go away when we come back. 96 Olympic bronze medalist Floyd Pretty Boy Mayweather will be in action tonight.